be done on earth. Justify to ourselves the reasons to go. Should we live and let live? Forget or forgive. But how will we let them go on this way? 
Maiden and Afraid to Shoot Strangers, a Steve Harris epic that tackles the subject of the Persian Gulf War. It's new off Fear of the Dark. Don't go away, because when we come back, there's more killer cuts from Fear of the Dark. Plus, Bruce Dickinson and Yannick Gers talk about Maiden's timely new lyrics, their refusal to compromise, and the plans for their new stage show. It's all here when Metal Shop's premiere of Fear of the Dark continues right now. Keep listening for your chance to enter our exciting new contest and live the wildlife with slaughter. Hi there, this is Bruce Dickinson of Iron Maiden. You're listening to the new Iron Maiden album, Fear of the Dark, right here on Metal Shop. Welcome back to Metal Shop's world premiere of the new Iron Maiden album, Fear of the Dark. I'm Charlie Kendall. Even though Maiden took plenty of time to write, prepare, and record this LP, things didn't always go smoothly in the studio. All five musicians and even producer Martin Birch had their temper tantrums, but Bruce Dickinson says that's just business as usual. If I don't punch out a section of the wall or throw a chair, I haven't done a record. It's the way we all are. We all know. I mean, Martin has his moments as well. On this one, he called everybody up at four in the morning once, completely drunk as a skunk, and said, That's it. I've sacked myself. He said, I'm off the album. I've finished. I'm washed up. <laughs> you know, and we said, Oh, yeah, OK. And then he just said, I'm going for a walk. And so he disappeared for like 24 hours, and he came out. It's perfectly all right. I mean, it's just, he's, he's done it on every album. It's going to happen. It's a stress, you know, it builds up. 